Have you ever wondered who will win the race to Mars, SpaceX, or NASA? In the vast expanse of the cosmos, a new frontier beckons, a crimson world of untapped potential and enigmatic intrigue. Mars, the fourth planet from our sun, has become the focus of a modern-day space race. A thrilling duel of intellect, innovation, and audacity has been ignited between two powerhouses of space exploration, SpaceX and NASA. This isn't a contest driven by Cold War politics or national pride, but by a shared vision of human destiny and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. It's an exciting era of competition, spurred by the ambitions of these two phenomenal entities, each with their own unique approach to conquering the cosmos. SpaceX, the brainchild of entrepreneur Elon Musk, has revolutionized the space industry with its reusable rockets and bold ambitions. It's a commercial venture, a pioneer in the private spaceflight industry, with an audacious goal to make life multiplanetary. For SpaceX, Mars isn't just a destination, it's the future home of humanity. On the other hand, we have NASA, the veteran of space exploration. With decades of experience and a legacy of lunar landings, Mars rovers, and space telescopes, NASA's mission is driven by scientific discovery and exploration. For NASA, Mars represents the next giant leap for mankind, a chance to unravel the mysteries of our solar system and maybe, just maybe, find signs of extraterrestrial life. Mars, our celestial neighbor, holds the promise of a new era for humanity. It's a world of frozen deserts, towering volcanoes, and deep canyons. A world that may hold the keys to understanding our own. It's the next frontier, a challenge that tests our technology, our ingenuity, and our spirit of exploration. So, let's delve into this thrilling interplanetary competition and see who's leading the race to the Red Planet. First up, let's focus on SpaceX's grand vision for Mars. At the heart of SpaceX's Martian dreams is the Starship spacecraft. This behemoth of technology, standing taller than the Statue of Liberty, is being designed to carry up to 100 humans to the Red Planet. It's a vision that Elon Musk, SpaceX's charismatic CEO, has been nurturing for years. He imagines a future where humans are a multi-planetary species with a self-sustaining city on Mars as a second home. The development of Starship has been quite the journey. This spacecraft is not just a vehicle, it's a symbol of human innovation, a testament to our desire to reach beyond the confines of our planet. The road to its creation has been paved with trials, errors, and extraordinary milestones. One such milestone was the first successful Starship test flight. The world watched in awe as the stainless steel Leviathan took to the skies, soaring to an altitude of six miles before making a controlled descent and landing back on Earth. This was a significant step forward in the grand scheme of SpaceX's Mars mission. It demonstrated that the ambitious goal of sending a giant spacecraft to Mars is not just a pipe dream, but a reality within our grasp. Yet the path to Mars is not just about building a capable spacecraft, it's about envisioning a future where life on Mars is possible. Elon Musk has described detailed plans for a self-sustaining city on Mars complete with infrastructure, industry, and a population in the hundreds of thousands. It's an extraordinary vision, one that would forever change the course of human history. But SpaceX is not alone in this race. NASA has its own plans for the Red Planet. Now let's turn our attention to NASA's Mars Exploration Program. Ever since the 70s, NASA has been sending spacecraft to the Red Planet, each mission more ambitious than the last. The Viking missions gave us our first close-up look at Mars, and the Pathfinder mission in the late 90s saw the first successful deployment of a rover, Sojourner, marking a significant milestone in Mars exploration. Fast forward to the 21st century, NASA's Mars exploration rovers, Spirit and Opportunity, captured the world's imagination with their stunning images and groundbreaking discoveries. Then came Curiosity a car-sized rover armed with an array of scientific instruments which has been exploring Gale Crater since 2012, uncovering secrets of Mars' past and hinting at the possibility of ancient microbial life. In February 2021, NASA's most recent rover, Perseverance, touched down on Mars. Perseverance's mission to seek signs of ancient life and collect samples of rock and regolith, broken rock and soil, for possible return to Earth. 
And let's not forget Ingenuity, the small helicopter that came with Perseverance, achieving the first powered flight on another planet. But NASA's plans for Mars go beyond rovers and helicopters. The space agency is developing the Artemis program, aiming to return humans to the moon by 2024 as a stepping stone for future Mars missions. The ultimate goal? To send human explorers to Mars in the 2030s. These astronauts will be tasked with conducting scientific research, demonstrating new technologies, and laying the groundwork for a sustainable outpost. As we look to the future, Mars continues to beckon, its mysteries waiting to be unraveled. It's a race against time and technology, with NASA and SpaceX pushing the boundaries of what's possible. Each mission, each discovery, brings us one step closer to setting foot on the Martian surface, to making interplanetary travel a reality. NASA and SpaceX, two contenders with their eyes set on one prize, Mars. But the journey to Mars is fraught with challenges. As we set our sights on the red planet, we must first navigate through a gauntlet of obstacles. First, there's the duration of the trip. Even with the most advanced propulsion technology, a one-way journey to Mars will take around six to nine months. This long-duration space travel not only tests the endurance of the crew, but also poses significant logistical issues. Think about the sheer amount of food, water, and oxygen required for such a trip. Then there's the issue of radiation exposure. Space is filled with high-energy particles which are harmful to human health. On Earth, our planet's magnetic field shields us from these particles. But in the vast expanse of space, astronauts are left exposed. Prolonged exposure can lead to a host of health problems, including increased risk of cancer. And let's not forget about landing on Mars. The Martian atmosphere is much thinner than Earth's, which makes slowing down a spacecraft for a safe landing extremely tricky. Remember the infamous seven minutes of terror during the Curiosity rover landing? That was a robotic mission. Now imagine the stakes with human lives on board. Against these formidable challenges, both SpaceX and NASA are engineering their way forward. SpaceX is developing Starship, a fully reusable spacecraft designed for long-duration interplanetary travel. It will have a built-in radiation shield and is being designed to land vertically on Mars. On the other hand, NASA is working on the Orion spacecraft and the Space Launch System. Orion is being designed to withstand the harsh radiation environment of deep space, and it will be equipped with a specially designed heat shield for Mars re-entry. These are just a few of the hurdles we need to overcome in our race to Mars. Each challenge is a puzzle, and both SpaceX and NASA are putting together the pieces, one by one. So who's likely to reach Mars first? Let's weigh in. The question remains, who will win the race to Mars? As we delve into this cosmic competition, we're faced with two formidable contenders, SpaceX and NASA. Each has chalked up impressive achievements, and each has a clear vision for Mars. So, who's leading in this interstellar sprint? On one hand, we have SpaceX, the maverick private company that's been shaking up the space industry. With its reusable rockets and the ambitious Starship project, SpaceX is pushing the boundaries of what's possible. Elon Musk's audacious goal of establishing a human colony on Mars by the middle of the 2030s has certainly captured the public imagination. But can they deliver on their promise? Well, SpaceX has a few things going for it. First, it's not reliant on government funding, which means it has a bit more flexibility when it comes to planning and executing its missions. Plus, its focus on developing cost-effective, reusable rockets could give it a leg up in the long run. On the other hand, we have NASA, the seasoned space veteran with decades of experience under its belt. With the successful landing of Perseverance on Mars, NASA has demonstrated its technological prowess and ability to execute complex missions. Their Artemis program, aiming to return humans to the moon as a stepping stone to Mars, is well underway. But NASA faces its own challenges. Its funding is dependent on the whims of Congress, and its bureaucratic nature can sometimes slow down progress. However, NASA's extensive experience and established infrastructure can't be discounted. In the end, it's a tough call to make. Both SpaceX and NASA have their strengths and weaknesses. The race to Mars is not just about speed, but also about sustainability, technological innovation, and the ability to adapt to unforeseen challenges. The race to Mars is on and the world is watching with bated breath. Who will win? Only time will tell. As we anticipate the outcome of this cosmic race, let's not forget the broader implications of reaching Mars. 
It's not just about who gets there first. It's about what this achievement would mean for humanity as a whole. A successful manned mission to Mars would be a giant leap forward in our understanding of the universe. It would open up new horizons for scientific exploration, potentially answering age-old questions about the existence of life beyond Earth. Furthermore, it would pave the way for advancements in technology and engineering as we overcome the challenges of interplanetary travel. The spin-offs from such innovation could have far-reaching benefits, revolutionizing industries and improving our quality of life on Earth. But perhaps most importantly, reaching Mars would be a testament to the power of human curiosity, resilience, and ingenuity. It would inspire future generations to dream big and reach for the stars. So, whether it's SpaceX or NASA that crosses the finish line first, the real winner would be humanity. As we stand on the brink of this new frontier, we're not just spectators in a space race, we're participants in an extraordinary journey of discovery that could redefine our place in the cosmos. If you learned something new from the video, then please give a like to the video and share your opinions in the comment. And don't forget to subscribe for more such content and also share it with your friends and families.